Hello everyone, hope all is well today. My name is Jean-Amat. Today we will discuss question 2 of numerical variables. Um, we are asked to build a stem and leaf plot uh, for a numerical variable which is counting the number of species at different locations in Texas. So for example, 150 represents 150 different species that have been located at that location in 2010. Okay, and so when building a stem and leaf plot, what we need to do is find the minimum, first of all. So here we have a minimum, which is 150. And let's try to find the maximum. I believe it's 231. So max is 231. And then the rightmost digit is going to represent, in each one of these numbers, is going to represent the leaf. So for example, 0 for 150, 1 for 231, and then the other number, so the remaining digits, will represent the stem. So here, 15 is the stem for 150, 23 is the stem for 231. So we need stems from 15 to 23. Okay, so I'll make a vertical bar, and then I put my stems. So 15, 16, 17, and so on. And then we should do this right up to 23. Okay, and now what we need to do is put in our leaves. Um, now the problem here with our numbers is that the values are not ordered in increasing order. And we would like to put our leaves in increasing order, and so we have to be careful. And so here let's put the 150s aside, so I have 150, and then 156, so 150, 156, and then what else, 150, 154, 150, 154, and then 159, 158, okay, and then what else, 150, and I think that's it. And so then if I were to uh, take the leaves for all of these in order, so I have uh, three zeros, so I put in my, my zeros, so zero, 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 and then I have four, six, eight, nine, so four, six, eight and nine. So that's it for the 150s. Okay, so then we do the same for the 160s and then so on. And so here I have 166, 164, so 166, 164, and then what else? 169, and then 164, 160, 164, 160. So I have zero and then two fours. So zero, two fours, and then I have six and nine, six and nine. Okay, so that's 160s, and now let's do the 170s. And so I have 175, 177, 178, 175, 177, 178. And do we have others? No, I think that's it. So five, seven, and eight. These are leaves in order. And then I have 183, so that's a 3 for the 18s. I have 189, or 99, sorry, 199. And then I have just have a few numbers left. So 203, so that's for the 20s. And then 216. And then 231. And so this is our, our stem and leaf plot. So this answers part A. And it's always nice to give a little legend here to explain what the leaves and the stem represent. So for example, we should put a note that if I were to have a stem of 21 with a leaf of 6, this is equivalent to saying that the number is equal to, oops, not 261, but 216. Okay, so this is a little note for for the plot. Um, in part B, we want to describe the distribution. So here, for example, if we try to, to describe the, the symmetry, uh, we see that the atypical values, or the, the tail of my distribution, extends to the right. And for the large values, so this we would say right, or skewed to the right. And then uh, we have some very large values. So for example, 231, uh, we should identify it as being a potential outlier and also that we have some large values, four values between 183 and 216. Okay. Um, if we were to try to describe the center, we could try to identify the medium. It's quite easy to find inside of the 
uh, stem and leaf plot. And so here we have how many values? Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So we have 20 values. And so if I, I take uh, 20 divided by 10, I'm sorry, but 20 divided by 2, this gives me 10th. And so I have the 10th and the 11th value, which represent the medium. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. If I, I count down my leaves, and so the 10th and the 11th would represent 164 and 166. So if I take the medium of these two values, uh, sorry, uh, sorry, the mean of these two values, I get 165. And so uh, the median number of species found at a location is 165. So this describes the center. And then to describe the dispersion, well, we could, ignoring the very large values that we identified, uh, 